I've got the Google Pixel 4a right here and today I want to show you how to boot this smartphone both into safe mode as well as how to boot out of safe mode. The number one troubleshooting step that I always recommend people do is to see if they can replicate any type of bug or poor user experience that they're currently having with their smartphone to try to replicate it when their phone is in safe mode. So Android has millions and millions and millions of applications available for download in the Play Store. And even though Google does do some scanning within these apps to make sure that there's no viruses or anything in there, Google is not going to make sure that these applications are bug free. They're not going to make sure that the applications are optimized for your battery. And they're not going to make sure that these applications in the Play Store don't conflict with other certain features on a smartphone, say Bluetooth, for example, or your mobile wireless data, for example. You would be surprised at how many third-party applications from the Play Store can interfere in even the most basic things like Bluetooth. So anytime you're ever experiencing anything wrong on the Google Pixel 4a, the first thing I would suggest is to boot it into safe mode and find out if you can replicate that issue. So to boot the Pixel 4a into safe mode, we first want to bring up the power menu. And we do that by pressing and holding on the power button. Then we're going to press and hold. We're going to do a long press on the restart button. And when we do that long press on the restart button, we're going to see a reboot to safe mode dialog button box pop up. Go ahead and tap on the OK button for that dialog box. And it's going to reboot your Google Pixel 4a and it's going to take us into and the Android operating system again, except this time it's going to enable and activate what, an what Android calls safe mode. So instead of going through all of your applications and all the games that you've installed from the Play Store and either disabling them one by one or uninstalling them one by one, we're able to boot the Google Pixel 4a into safe mode, which will disable any and all third-party applications on the device. So all applications that were not installed on the phone out of the box and that you installed manually afterwards are going to be disabled when we boot the device into safe mode. So when you do a reboot like this, you're going to see the safe mode watermark down at the bottom left. That's going to always be there no matter what screen you look at as a reminder of why you cannot open or even see if you're looking in the app drawer using the default launcher third party applications that have been disabled in this way. So the goal here is to tell the Android operating system to disable any and all third-party applications all at once when you're in safe mode so that you don't have to manually disable or uninstall them yourself. And if you have any in the home screen of any launcher really, you're probably going to see the third-party applications that have been disabled. They're going to be grayed out you're not going to be able to open them. So no matter what you're experiencing on Android, whether it is poor battery life, a buggy user interface, maybe you're having a bunch of force closes, poor performance, an overheating battery, all of these type of issues, even Bluetooth connection and pairing issues, all of these issues I would always boot the Google Pixel 4a into safe mode 
to test and make sure that I can replicate those issues in safe mode. Because if I can't, then it's one of my third-party applications that's causing the issue, and I need to go through and find out which one it is. However, if it is, if it can be replicated within safe mode, then the issue is likely something more serious, something with the Android operating system itself, and from there I'm going to need to do a factory data reset or return to stock by manually flashing the factory firmware images. Now whenever you're done doing your testing here and you want to get out of safe mode and you want to be able to use your third-party apps again, or heck, Maybe you have booted up into Android into safe mode by accident. Very possible. To get out of safe mode, we simply need to reboot the device. So we're going to bring up the power menu again. We simply tap on the restart button and we wait for the Google Pixel 4a to restart back into the Android operating system. Now, as long as you're not pressing any buttons, as long as we didn't initiate this restart by pressing and holding on that restart button and telling Android to boot into safe mode again, as long as you do a regular reboot or a regular shutdown and restart, then it should reboot normally and you will not boot into safe mode again. And again, we can check by making sure that the safe mode watermark is not present and that our applications are no longer grayed out. So that is how to boot the Google Pixel 4a both into safe mode as well as out of safe mode.